We all know Feed Me Oil is a great game for the iOS, including 75 levels of increasing difficulty and a lot of items used to guide the oil. But have you ever always wondered? I wish there were more levels. Well, the surprising part was, there were more levels. This is where the bonus parts of this series is going to talk about. About some bonus levels, the anti-gravity pack, and a sixth chapter. This video serves as a continuation for the anti-gravity levels, so if you haven't watched part 1 yet, please go fix that right now and watch it. The link for the video will be in the description. Now, on with the video. Okay, so starting off things, we have the first level, and it might take you a while to place it in the right position, but whatever it works. Our next level is level 2. It's a little bit hard, but I think it's gonna be okay. Also, I'm comparing of how I beat the level compared to the guy who did it, which I say credit, which I gave credit to in the beginning of the anti-gravity pack. It's really hard, this level's really hard since sometimes you cannot get enough oil, but uh, sometimes you can get really lucky, and he did as well. Level 4 was the very first level which I got stuck on, but uh, that didn't stop me as just recently in 2024, I was able to beat it with 3 stars. What you need to do was to, apparently, you had to make sure you did the following. But the problem here is the second fan to the right. Um, it's because uh, I, I'm trying to get oil into it, and sometimes it's not enough. I, I tried it and I didn't do it. Um, but at times I can get really lucky. Uh, but finally I was able to do it. Okay, our next level, 2-5, was really interesting. But uh, it was hard. But I was able to get it on the first try. And wow, this level is really crazy for an anti gravity 3 star. Level 2 5 had the 6 had the thing with spinning revolving removed, um, but it came back in the modern day version. So it's a good thing I did find something around, I find it around. Um, I'm pretty sure I must have placed a fan to the side where the spinning blue wind was and I placed another platform to which the fan on the right side of the screen was um, and that's how I was able to beat the level. As you can see this guy used exactly four unused elements so uh, if you do have the old day on, old version with anti-gravity on then uh, please do the following. Levels 2-7 was the one that started it all. Even when trying to go for the one star hints, um, they will not give, they are, they are inaccurate and this is because it's placed, the thing, the red thing is placed a little bit to the right and tilted a little bit, but kept the same in the old version. Ah, this one was really hard, since unfortunately it is not possible to get the button when going for three stars, but it is for going for one star. I tried it and it didn't work. Um, but I was able to somehow successfully be able to beat this level 3 stars. And, wow, I need to say, it took a lot of time, since apparently, the thing is really high, and apparently, when oil goes back, is, exits out of the screen, it gets teleported back to the, to the pipe. Um, but in this case, I got very lucky, and apparently the person did this as well. I know I'm repeating this stuff, but uh, I don't know what else to say. Level 2-9, two, apparently he clearly used 4 unused elements, but you could add an extra platform to make, make it really easy, since uh, this guy likes to go for high score and not just 3 stars. I, however, just want to go for 3 stars. It was really hard since a lot of the oil likes to to escape from the magnet at the pivot point and at the top, as you as you just saw right there. Level 10 was very, very hard. I mean, this must have probably taken like a hundred attempts to get it right. Yeah. Um, you cannot use more elements since this guy is said three unused elements. Level 11 had the big magnet and he was also using four unused elements. And I was able to add another fan to make it even easier. 
since I only opt to go for three stars instead of just go for high instead of going for high score. Level two is our next level, and boy, this is a lot of sickness that is going on. I even doubted myself I was able to beat it, mainly because I had to separate the two oh, the two pathways right here. Um, but yeah, I was somehow able to. You're never gonna guess. Um, get it on the first try. <laughs> Wow, that must have been really good. Uh, okay then. Our next level is level 2-13. Seen right here, he already uses the gravity and I was worried about the oil teleporting back to the pipe, but you can tell that apparently it did not. And this also was the same thing for me. But the next level, 2-14, really gave me a hitch. You can see here that apparently this is just inconsistent, and this is and this and this is the big reason of why I wanted to wanted it to be different. Shown in a comparison, you can see that the both the magnets, one is larger and one is shrunken down, and unfortunately, the shrunken down magnet makes it less more likely to do swaves like this, and that's why I needed fixing the modern day version. And this is the last level, 2-15. It's a little bit hard, but I think you can get it. Uh, but that's it for the Red Alert level. Stay tuned for Defeat Me All chapter.